Hello guys, let's read a story. First Day Jitters by Julie Danneberg, illustrated by Judy Love. First Day Jitters. That dog has a lunchbox. <laughs> First Day Jitters. The alarm clock. Ring, 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 ring. Oh, it scared the cat and the dog. Sarah, dear, time to get out of bed, Mr. Hartwell said, poking his head through the bedroom doorway. You don't want to miss the first day of your new school, do you? I'm not going, said Sarah, and she pulled the covers over her head. Of course you're going, honey, said Mr. Hartwell as he walked over to the window and snapped up the shade. <laughs> no, I'm not. I don't want to start over again. I hate my new school, Sarah said. She tunneled down to the end of her bed. How can you hate your new school, sweetheart? Mr. Hartwell chuckled. You've never been there before. Don't worry. You liked your other school. You'll like this one. Besides, just think of all the new friends you'll meet. That's just it. I don't know anybody, and it will be hard. And I just, I just hate it, that's all. What will everyone think if you aren't there? We told them you were coming. <gasps> they will think that I am lucky, and they will wish that they were at home in bed like me. <sighs> Mr. Hartwell sighed. Sarah Jane Hartwell, I'm not playing this silly game one second longer. I'll see you downstairs in five minutes. Sarah tumbled out of bed. She stumbled into the bathroom. She fumbled into her clothes. My head hurts, she moaned as she trudged into the kitchen. Mr. Hartwell handed Sarah a piece of toast and her lunchbox. They walked to the car. Sarah's hands were cold and clammy. They drove down the street. She couldn't breathe. And then they were there. I feel sick, said Sarah, weakly. Nonsense, said Mr. Hartwell. You'll love your new school once you get started. Oh, look, there's your principal, Miss Burton. Sarah slumped down in her seat. <laughs> oh, Sarah! Miss Burton gushed, be peeking into the car. There you are! Come on, I'll show you where to go! She led Sarah into the building and walked quickly through the crowded hallways. Don't worry, everyone is nervous the first day she said over her shoulder as Sarah rushed to keep up. When they got to the classroom, most of the children were already in their seats. The class looked up as Miss Burton cleared her throat. <clears> throat. Class, class, pay attention please, said Miss Burton. When the class was quiet, she led Sarah to the front of the room and said, Class, I would like you to meet <gasps> your new teacher, Miss Sarah Jane Hartwell. <laughs> That's so silly. It was the teacher who was nervous. Oh, silly Miss Hartwell. Have you been nervous before? <gasps> Are you nervous to come to school? Hmm. What do you think you could do if you're nervous? Could you talk to your mom and dad? 
could you talk to your teacher, Miss Dalton? Yeah, of course. There's lots of people we can talk to when we get nervous, and it's okay to be nervous. Even Miss Hartwell was nervous. Awesome. That was a great story. I'll see you next time at our next story.